Hey, have you ever wondered why we use the flask dunder name and not something like the flask bracket, some module name, when creating the instance of the flask app in Python? Stay here for a while and you'll know why. So, you're building a flask app, and at the very beginning, you create an instance of the flask class. But instead of just creating a flask instance, you pass the dunder name to the flask instance. Why is it so? By passing dunder name as an argument, you're basically telling Flask, hey, I'm running as the main program right now. This is important for Flask to set up paths and configurations correctly based on the location of your app. When you run a Python file, the dunder name variable is set to dunder main. But if you import that file as a module into another script, the dunder name is set to the name of the script oblique module. Let me show you a case in which you have passed a fixed name, for instance, main, when instantiating the Flask class, it would be technically acceptable, but it might not be the most flexible or conventional approach. This is because Flask expects the dunder name variable to determine the root path and context, and using a fixed name might lead to issues when importing the Flask instance into another script. Let's illustrate this with an example. Imagine we have two Python files, main underscore app dot py and another underscore script dot py. In main underscore app dot py, we have this code. In another underscore script dot py, we have this. In this example, when you import the Flask instance, app, into another script, Flask still sees the fixed name main. This could potentially lead to issues related to paths, configurations, or routing, as Flask won't recognize that it's being imported into another script. A more conventional and recommended approach is to use Flask dunder name in the main script. This way, when you import the Flask instance into another script, Flask dynamically adapts to the context using the actual name of the module. So, the magic of Flask dunder name is all about giving Flask the context it needs. It's like telling Flask, hey, I'm the main deal right now. Using a fixed module name wouldn't convey that information properly. So, is it a fixed rule to use Flask bracket dunder name? No, it's not a rule written somewhere, but it's a solid convention and a recommended method. You can technically do flask bracket whatever, but why complicate things? What if you ignore this convention and pass the module name to the flask instance? Flask might get a bit confused about its surroundings. It could mess up root paths, resource locations. Basically, it might misbehave. So, to wrap it up, flask dunder name is like telling flask, I know who I am and I'm ready to roll. It avoids confusion and helps flask set things up right. Now it's up to you if you want to make it complicated or keep things simple for Flask. Thanks for tuning in. That's all for now. And as always, keep coding.